uh, it's a coming of age story. So a uh, 16 year old schoolgirl, suddenly uh, in her village, uh, the men start to go insane and uh, killing w every woman in sight. And so the story is really about a uh, survivor, schoolgirl, and how she has to become a woman and also uh, how, how she has to fight back. Uh, it's definitely a mix of different uh, influence, uh, but I lived in uh, rural Japan, countryside, for uh, four years. And uh, a lot of the inspiration for the landscape, the way we shot the film, the landscapes, um, and also the personality of the schoolgirl comes from my, my time in northern Japan. Uh, and then uh, I'm a big fan of uh, horror manga, Japanese horror manga. And in particular, one manga writer, his name is uh, Umezu, uh, Kazuo Umezu. And uh, so uh, I consider him a very, like a master of horror storytelling. And so uh, especially the horror section of my film is very much based on the way he uh, organized his images in his manga. I think because of the recent trend in Japanese cinema, it, it a lot of people, uh, it's, they, of course, fairly, they understand it to be something else. Uh, they think probably that with that title, it's like 100% exploitation film. Uh, so, you know, I like those films too, a lot. And uh, so in that case, those films have like kind of much more violence, maybe a high percentage of uh, scenes, violent scenes that kind of keep you interested. And then uh, maybe some nudity or something, you know, that uh, also keeps you interested. But. Uh, I think in, in the case of my film, it's a very personal film. Uh, maybe in, in terms of zombie film, it's, it's more alternative zombie type film, uh, really following the, the main character who's the schoolgirl. And uh, I, w I think it's a very personal apocalypse for the schoolgirl. So that's how we really thought about the, the concept. Yeah.